where you shoot one time regardless of how many points it would represent. Brown at the end of the shot clock gets it off, but it goes zone sometimes. Coach said it just wants to make the other team think. And if it takes you an extra beat or two to figure out, oof. He's been really efficient from the three point line coming into this game, shooting 40% from deep. That's impressive, especially considering the different distance in the G League from where he's coming. Shot. You could be looking at four feet deeper from 19 9 to 23 9. Down to seven to shoot. A day murky will trigger and back to backs. And to the shot clock mix to Demps for three. And the top eight qualify for single elimination playoffs. Mix into Johnson to be a difference maker. Briscoe firing away, nicks the rebound, saying that sometimes it's not just the Coach had a game that night, and he said, well, can I play? And he did. Nick's off target, fires, which is why he's not currently down with the team in Lake Buena Vista, Florida. But with the games for the Philippines delayed, feet touch kicking and eventually finding Barry for the open three. Really push it, putting pressure on the Ignite D. Nice touch there by. The avoid contact frame. <laughs> no bully ball. 18 G League teams are down there competing in 15 games. Over 20 fifths, fifth in field goal percentage. Shooting 65% from the floor. And the Wolves extend this from deep. He gets to play alongside a guy like Jared Jack, who spent 14 years in the league. Nick, no. Shot clock is off. Briscoe against Nix. Efficient from both the field and, the, and from three and from the free throw line as well. As he, he, he never hung his head. He never looked like a guy who was frustrated. Dems dribbled in. Ignite led by seven in this quarter. Iowa has come back to take the lead. Green wants it back. Canyon Barry could not hit on the reverse. And now Dacian Nix, one on three, powering his way in. Dacian Nix lost the dribble. Wigginton kicking out. Tucker, the pump fake. I appreciate the layup, guys. You know, they're out. No defense between them and the basket. Lay it up. I don't know if Hearn was ever a. Cody Dents for three. And definitely like a bank layup guy, not even a finger roll. Great <laughs> guy. His third triple. Focused. They trailed by seven early in the third. So an 18 point turnaround. Seconds. That's what you gotta do when you got a big guy on you. Skip to depths, change of direction, pushing in against Tucker. Patiently waits. He's my favorite player to listen to so far in the bubble. Cook. <laughs> Cook denied by Kaminga. They got the matchup they wanted. Jack was. You can hear Jared Jack saying attack it with the shot clock winding down. Nix forces it up. That's a good time to get your first points of the game, young man. Two days after scoring 25 protocols with regards to quarantine and negative COVID tests. So for how good a line, 
But that last free throw was worth two points. He hit an earlier free throw that was worth three. And so he's been able Dante Green, or excuse me, Dante Hall with four blocks. Timberwolves in the preseason, launching from three. That's an air ball. Saved by Brown. Green, good defense against Brown, forcing it up. Jack. So deadlocked at 85. And maybe the best closer in the league and Jack on the floor, finding Nick. He's out on the floor. Yeah, he, it is so helpful to have a guy who communicates like that when you have a team full of young players. Knicks. Ignite plus three. Dacian Nix has all six of his points in the fourth quarter. Good block. Nix is there. Terrific touch pass. Then the offensive board and finish. Two and a quarter minutes to four and oh. The ball movement. Now Nix to Hall in Iowa's favor from down 11, down seven to up 11. And now Ignite goes down 11 to up seven in this. Final minute 40. Underneath. Knicks driving. Kaminga didn't want it. Now Nix in the corner, stepping back over Cook. Jack dribbling into space. Green driving in. Into Cook. Trier. Rebounding, we good. Let's go home. 